Hello everybody, this is Fadi and in this tutorial I will show you how to change transparency ratio through design option feature. This means that you don't have to uh, create a Revit file for each option. You can work on the same file and changing any design option. As you see here, I have options for the transparency ratio of the facade. So how we can do that? Let's do together. First of all, you can reach to design option from manage tab and click on it. I had previously created this option uh, in order to show you, uh, but now I can delete it or accept the primary in order to start from the scratch. Also, I have to tell you that you can reach to design option uh, tab from this icon below. So directly you can come here. Okay, now first of all, I have to create a new option set and then I have to uh, rename it to maybe uh, facade transparency ratio options and this is the main set and here under there we we, we can see uh, sub options we can add as much as we want in our case we want five and we can rename them as 100 percent and 75 percent For option 3, I will give 50% and for option 4, I will give 25% and for the last one, I will give 0%. Now we are ready with facade transparency ratio options. We can close this. Okay, now we can select the window select all instances and we can also uh, select the wall this is important because the window are hosted in the wall now we can go here below and add these components to set as you see we can add these components to all the options we have created then as you see when i select all the project uh, just the uh, option components will not be selected then i can go to 100 percent and also select the windows and change them from the properties i have previously created these you can calculate your walls and the percent from uh, the ratio between uh, your walls and windows and create them by the type of the window family okay i will choose 100 percent maybe the cell height also good so now i can add this to the set here i have something that holding me error none of the selected element can be added to this option okay i will reselect them and maybe because this is primary i can go here to 75 and then select the windows and give 75 maybe i can also change the cell height to 0 0.25 and as you see here i have the option now i can go to 50 and select all of them and go to 50 and give a cell height maybe 0 0.5 okay now maybe we can go to 25 select all the windows and also changing the cell height to 1 but we have to change to 25 okay go to 0 maybe i can select all the windows 
and then delete them and as you see we have created design options for the uh, the transparency ratio that's too much for this video i wish that you are interested in this video please like and share this video if you are interested in more videos and have a nice day goodbye